Liv, the trade to Melbourne was a long time coming. You must be relieved and excited that it's all done now. Yeah, I'm definitely relieved. I'm super excited. Um, the girls have been really supportive and I've felt a lot of love and warmth um, from the club already. So I'm just excited for that free season to come around and to get stuck into things. Not the ideal time to join a new club given everything that's going on in Victoria, but have you met any of your new teammates? Yeah, it's, it's a weird time at the moment um, in Victoria, but I've met a couple of the girls down the coast, a couple of them are staying down there. We've done some footy stuff together and a few coffees here and there. So yeah, again, the girls have been super supportive and nice and I just can't wait to meet um, everyone soon. You are coming off a knee injury. How is that rehab going? Yeah, it's going really well. Um, I've been three months in and I've started running, so just hoping to keep ticking off little goals here and there and um, have a good, get a good pre-season together and see what happens. Um, the physios again have been really awesome with getting a program together and um, helping me out there. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. A December start date's probably not ideal coming off an ACL, so are you looking more of a long-term future with Melbourne? Yeah, definitely looking for a long-term future and I'm not in a rush um, to get back um, at a certain time. I'm just hoping when my body feels okay and when the physios say I'm all good, but I'm just excited to get amongst the girls and hopefully add some value to the team and just more importantly, wanting to grow and learn off all, all the players as well. In terms of your football, what can fans expect to see from you out on the field? I'm hoping I can bring that competitiveness and playing the midfield as an inside mid and um, help with clean hands and yeah, just um, do what I can on the field, just be tough and competitive and have that will to win, I guess. No doubt you'd be familiar with a few names in the Melbourne midfield. Are there any girls in particular you're looking forward to playing alongside? Um, probably all of them, to be honest. I, I've, I've watched a lot of the girls play over the past few years, so I'm really excited to play, um, yeah, obviously with Paxi, Hanksy, Maddie Gay um, and Loz Piers. She's a really good ruck, so it'd be nice having a few taps from her, that'd be cool. <laughs> you are only 20, but do you feel like you're at an age where you can impact this level? A lot of the younger girls are starting to take over the league. Um, yeah, I think I can impact the game. I think um, I have value to bring, but I also think I'm still so young and I've still got a lot to learn, so I'm really, that's why I'm really excited to learn off the Melbourne midfield group um, and really grow um, my game and from the coaches as well. So. Yeah, it's more about um, just keep growing and learning as a player and um, hopefully just yeah, improving myself as a person and a player too. Well, we're looking forward to seeing you get started. Thanks for your time, Liv. Thanks, man.